to the Future Chicken Today Show! I'm Circuitry, time twisting you in from the future, 2050, with our host, extraordinaire, Potato the Chicken, and Potata the Egg. Hello! Do we have a great show for you? Today's guest from your time is the amazing influencer and digital game creator, Mackenzie Turner! <laughs> Mackenzie not only uses her voice to influence kids to do great things, she's also incredibly creative and, spoiler alert, she's created a game idea just for us! Right, Frittata? Come on, Cosmic Egg, we got this. Frittata? Watch out for the... No! Frittata! Rocket Pants! The show started! What? Oh, uh, on it! Right after I finish this level of Cosmic Egg Obby Challenge! Our favorite game, right, Rocket Pants? Oh, affirmative! Well, today's guest from the present is one of our favorite gamers and influencers, Mackenzie Turner! THE Mackenzie Turner? Oh, boy! Awesome! Hey, maybe she can help me defeat Cosmic Egg's nemesis, the deviously foul rat egg! <laughs> I had offered to neutralize the bad egg, but Frittata shut me down. How about shutting down the screen time to get some, uh, green time, Frittata? <laughs> Nothing better than connecting with the great outdoors! It'll keep you rooted! Oh, prime evil tree joke. What a sap. Hey, and calm you down. Calm me down? Why would you say that? I, I'm perfectly calm. Uh, well, sometimes you spin when you get stressed out. I promise to get more green time after this next level. But you need more green! 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 You know, I say we time twist Mackenzie Turner to the show. She seems to balance both. Great idea. Yeah. Major circuitry. Here, Frittata's over there. Huh? Woohoo! Neutralize, neutralize! Frittata! Frittata! Uh, coming! Time twister portal opening in three, two, one! Hi, Potato! Hey, Frittata! Hi! Hi, Mackenzie! Some of our planet protector friends might not know that you are a super popular influencer. Can you tell us what that is exactly? Yeah, so I make videos on YouTube. Now before we get going, make sure to like this video, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. Specifically videos for eight to 10 year olds. I love to go into the gaming world and create these stories. As an influencer, it's crazy because what you do online can really influence what the kids like to do. I'll say, I've been influenced already. Check out my McKenzie inspired outfit. Affirmative, we have never looked better. <laughs> If you had to create a digital world around me, what would it be like? And how could we use the game to get players outside in nature, which is my favorite place? I thought it would be so fun if it's this kind of very futuristic farm. So I'm talking like robotic scarecrows or even like hovering tractors. And I thought it would be super cool if we had future chicken in the game and she gave the players little tasks to do even in real life. Maybe some of the tasks could be like, take a picture of a specific plant or a leaf or planting a seed. You could do this in your backyard. You could do this at a local park and bring it back, show your picture in an in-game portal. And once Future Chicken sees that you completed the task, then Future Chicken could lay her eggs, give them to you. And now you have these eggs that could hatch and be little chickens on your farm. I love it. Oh yeah. <laughs> A lot of us love screen time. Affirmative. Yes, we do. Woohoo! But do you think it's important to balance digital time with time spent outdoors? Or like I like to call it, green time? I definitely think it is very important. It's hard for me not to be connected to nature because I feel like it's all around me where I live. So the first thing I like to do is go out for a walk, get some fresh air, get some sunlight on you. Sun is very important. Ah. A lot of the planet protectors that are listening or watching today are kids. Could you share some simple steps that kids could take to help the environment? And I think it is very important to do the small things that kind of build up to being a big change. 
So for example, when you're brushing your teeth, in between the brushes, you can turn off that water. I do it, I do it myself. So I think you guys should do it as well. When you pack your lunch in the morning, I think it's really important to make sure you're using reusable containers, putting your trash in the right areas where it should go. You need to reduce, reuse, recycle. You need to go out there and you need to make the change happen, right? Yeah. Mackenzie, are you hopeful about the future of our planet? I definitely am hopeful about the future of our planet because I feel like kids now, they are so smart with like technology and stuff. And I think these kids are so creative. I feel like it's so much easier to spread these ideas through the world right now through social media, right? Especially with all these influencers as well. Yes, I think social media has such great power to influence people for positive change. Definitely, I feel like our planet is in good hands. Whoa, Mackenzie is so awesome. Can you believe she created a whole game inspired by our life here on the farm? Yes! In fact, a lot of video games were inspired by nature. They were? Cool. Shigeru Miyamoto, one of the most successful video game creators of all time, <laughs> including Mario and Donkey Kong, came up with his very first idea while outdoors observing animals, bugs, and plants. Ah, he took green time and turned it into screen time. Hmm, maybe I should go outdoors, but I'm almost finished my game. But for Tata, just look at all the fun we can have outside. <laughs> Everything is fun and sometimes serene When I'm outdoors, surrounded by green Connecting with nature is what I love to do Some days I go from green to deep blue Everything is fun, my game screen Zapping fat eggs with my laser beam Braving new battles and I always want more But I do like the thrill when I hike and explore Balance is the key So let's find our symmetry Balancing the fresh air on our face. And another, yes, another, yet another, another round of cosmic eggs in space. Blasters ignite, nature awaits. Let's go! While those two get a nature recharge, let's check in with some planet protectors and see how they've been inspired by their own green time. Ooh, a journey stick! They come from indigenous storytelling practices. You can make one by tying onto a stick the meaningful items you find on a nature walk. Then you can use your journey stick to retell your adventure to others. Yeah! Thanks, planet protectors. Seeing you inspired by nature really plucks my heartstrings. Incoming! I believe we should slow the roll, Frisada. We just saw a squirrel leap from a fence into the coop like Binga Binga Boop, super easy. And they don't even have thrusters. And ants so tiny, but they could lift these enormous leaves. Again, without thrusters. Wow, sounds like a great adventure. Mackenzie was right. Spending time outdoors does make you feel better. She totally influenced me. Well, she is an influencer. Gotta go, Potato. I need to get back to my Cosmic Egg Buddies. What? Oh, wait, you're going back to your game? Why? I'm gonna do a little influencing of my own. Oh? I can't wait to inspire my gamer friends to find some screen time, green time balance. Back in the Cosmic Flash. <laughs> this day just keeps getting better. And there's so much more to come. Are you ready, Circuitry? I was sprouted ready. Let's bring back our awesome friend, Mackenzie Turner, for a fun game of Would You Rather? Would you rather climb to the top of a mountain or ride a submarine to the bottom of the ocean? I think I would definitely climb to the top of a mountain because going to the bottom of the ocean kind of freaks me out. Would you rather spend a night in an igloo in the Arctic or in the treehouse in the Amazon? Ooh, I think an igloo. Huh? Because especially where I'm from, I get a lot of snow. So I love the snow a lot. Oh, you might even see some polar bears up there. Ooh, that would be great. Would you rather play a video game against cats or dogs? Definitely dogs. I'm a dog person for sure. Or maybe you could play with a chicken. Yeah, give me all the chickens. And would you rather go hang gliding with a chicken or surfing with an egg? Hang gliding with a chicken. I think we would have a lot of fun. Thank you 
so much, Mackenzie. That ends our game. Thank you so much for having me. That was so fun. Hey, taters. You look so happy, Frittata. I successfully influenced a few friends. I may have found my calling. Speaking of calling, your game is trying to get your attention. Are you gonna get that? Nope. I've got a better idea. Let's take this game from the screen into the green. Cosplay! I claim cosmic egg. And I'll be the bad rotten egg. Egg timer's up. Time to get scrabble. And I'll be Rocket Pants. Prepare to be neutralized. Ah, oh, wait. It's just the game, Rocket Pants. Uh, disengage neutralizer, RP. Disengage. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for joining us in 2050. And remember, together, we make the future. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs>